managing director of the company, Garba Haruna, said it was a tremendous achievement to have reached an agreement after several meetings with the unions on the issue of staff, welfare, and conditions of service. Today, we are witnessing a historic day. We are highly delighted that we have reached an agreement with the union that we are signing a condition of service which I'm sure that there are a lot of discourse struggling with it up to now. So today we're able to, to mark it on our diary. After more than 50 meetings, <laughs> as mentioned by the chairman of the committee, after lots of deliberation back and forth, today we're here signing a historic document and a very important document for everybody. According to the president, Senior Staff Association of Electricity and Allied Companies said the conditions of service will now serve as a law guiding both the company and the employees on critical matters. The General Secretary of the National Union of Electricity Employees, Comrade Joe Ajero, who was part of the struggle, also expresses his view on the decision. At the end of the meeting, both the union leaders and the company management signed the new conditions of service document designed to ensure welfare of the staff and to serve as a guidance and prevention of unreasonable disengagement of the company employees. Sani Abdullahi Hurgasa, Liberty News.